Hi students, this is Viswanath, Chemistry Faculty for NEET and IIT exams. Last class we have completed reduction of nitrobenzene in alkaline medium. Now see the next one. Reduction of nitrobenzene in electrolytic conditions. Electrolytic condition means generally electrolysis means by passing electricity through a solution of a particular substance. If we convert that substance into another substances that is called electrolysis. Now reduction process takes place electrolytically. That means by passing electricity through the solution of nitrobenzene in presence of acidic condition in, in presence of an acid or base then it undergoes reduction. This is called electrolytic reduction. A reduction takes place electrolytically in acidic medium and also basic medium. First see this acidic medium electrolytic reduction in acidic medium. In this two types are there. One is weakly acidic medium. One is weakly acidic medium. Weakly acidic medium. That means weak acidic medium conditions if we provide then what is the reduction product? Say this nitrobenzene. This is nitrobenzene. Undergo reduction in weak acidic medium. That means pH value 6 to 7. Weakly acidic medium. Then we can get the product aniline. Okay, so this is the reduction of electrolytic reduction of nitrobenzene in weak acidic medium. This is nitrobenzene and product is this one aniline. In strong acidic condition, what is the electrolytic reduction of nitrobenzene? See here strong acidic condition nitrobenzene. pH equal to 2 to 3. This is strong acidic condition. Strong acidic medium. Then we can get phenyl hydroxyl amine C6H5NHOH. This is phenyl hydroxyl amine. And this compound undergoes rearrangement. Undergoes rearrangement. Then we can get para aminophenol. By rearrangement of this compound, we can get this product para aminophenol. This is nitrobenzene. So in weak acidic medium, nitrobenzene undergoes electrolytic reduction and forms aniline. And strong acidic conditions, it forms phenyl hydroxyl amine, it undergoes rearrangement and gives para aminophenol. And in the same way, electrolytic reduction in alkaline medium. In alkaline medium, what is the reduction product of nitrobenzene? See this, nitrobenzene undergoes electrolytic reduction in electrolyte in alkaline medium and forms different products. See this one, alkaline medium. Then we can get this one. Nitrosobenzene and also phenyl hydroxyl amine. Phenyl hydroxyl amine. This is nitrosobenzene.
this is phenyl hydroxyl amine now between these products condensation takes place between nitrous of benzene and phenyl hydroxyl amine condensation reaction takes place now i will show you how that reaction takes place see this this is nitrous of benzene plus phenyl hydroxyl amine this one this is nitrous of benzene and this is phenyl hydroxyl amine now here nucleophilic attack takes place nitrogen atom present in phenyl hydroxyl amine acts as a nucleophile and this nitrogen attacks the this lone pair of electron present on this nitrogen attacks the nitrogen atom of nitrosyl in this compound this is nitrosyl nitrogen atom and this one nucleophilic attack in hydroxyl amine nitrogen having lone pair of electrons so it can acts as a nucleophile then nucleophilic attacking takes place on the nitrogen atom of nitrosyl nitroso benzene so then we can get see this one this bonding shifting in this direction pi electrons are shifted to oxygen because between nitrogen and oxygen oxygen is more electronegative element so pi electrons are shifted to oxygen atom then we can get this species negative charge is developed on this now positive charge is developed on this nitrogen now this reaction takes place in presence of base then what happens this oh minus attacks this hydrogen atom these bonding electrons are shifted to this nitrogen and this oh minus abstracts this h plus and is removed in the form of water then we can get n o lone pair okay now in the next case this lone pair of electrons are shifted here and this bonding electrons are shifted to oxygen atom then we can get this one this oh group is removed in the form of oh minus ion so this is ejoxy benzene ejoxy benzene okay so see this one carefully this is nitrous of benzene nitrous of benzene and this one phenyl hydroxyl amine in this compound nitrogen atom having lone pair of electrons here between this lone pair and a lone pairs present on the oxygen atom repulsive forces are dominating that's why this nitrogen atom can act as a nucleophile and attacks nitrogen atom of this compound then these pi electrons are shifted to oxygen in this case we can get this species and then oh minus ion abstract h plus from this 
because reaction takes place in alkaline medium so oh minus ion can take this hydrogen this bonding electron pair shifted to nitrogen lone pair is developed on this nitrogen is formed on this nitrogen in the last step this lone pair of electrons are shifted here then oh group is removed in the form of oh minus here water molecule is removed okay so finally we can get azoxy benzene